hi guys and welcome to our channel i love channel so today I am gonna review the B Beauty from Big W the makeup that they have this cost two dollars each now you can buy it at any Big W stores nationwide I believe um, Big W is not available in America or any other country countries that's what I know correct me if I'm wrong but today I'm gonna do a review on these makeup items so I've got a bronzing powder a blush powder also what else did I get um, I got an eyeliner pencil but I'm gonna use this as a lip pencil and also a duo eyeshadow so let's try these beauties um, so I've basically done my foundation and the concealer and then I'm just gonna set my face with the OTW over in rose gold this is in the shade 03. So I'm just gonna set my face with that first. <coughs> Using a really fluffy brush. I don't like to set my face with the sponge that comes with it because I feel like it make it makes it look kind of patchy. Is it just me or does it happen to all the setting powders? Okay. Take the shine off my face. Oh, by the way, I'm just using natural light so you can really see my skin tone. No. Oh, forgot to mention, I also got the Big Beauty Cream Lip Pencil. So I'm just going to use this as a lipstick on top of a lip pencil. Now we're going to try to put on this one if I can open it so we're gonna do the bronzing powder so you just you can just open it like that it's just as soon as cheap packaging first off but what can you say for two dollars I mean you cannot really expect a lot now it's got a it's got a glitter spray on top you guys can see that really closely and it's got seven grams of product in it it's got uh, makeup magnesium so whatever everything there is um, and you have to store it below 22 degrees it's available in all big W's it's a glow bronzing powder and I'm just too scared that I might be a bit too brown I don't know too dark for me Does that make a difference? <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna really like, pat it in. Oh, there you go. So to be able to get product on your face, you have to really, really dip it in. guys I just got a little bit of allergies here because um, I ate a bit of prawns last night um, let's just ignore that <laughs> And uh, I've got that mark there from years ago when I bumped my head and I am going to see a dermatologist to treat it. It's, uh, they said, the laser clinic said that it was kind of a bruising under the skin. So I'm just going to have that checked as well. It's this and that one. It's 
It's alright. I mean, I think I, <laughs> I think it's like okay for a bronzer, for a two dollar bronzer. You can't complain, right? Um, the blendability, I would say not so much because then, as you can see, I really had to like buff it out, you know, I really had to actually brush it really, really hard on my skin to be able to have product on. Like, really put it in. There you go. Yeah. Put it here. There we go. Okay, that's it. Now we're moving on to the blush powder, and I've got the red bean blush. Red bean blush powder. Same packaging as the bronzer. Now let's get a this is my blush brush. This is a stippling brush, and normally you wouldn't use this as a blush brush, but I really like the finish of it on my skin. So let's just oh I, I should have cleaned that before this video. <laughs> but it just comes in this color. This is the red bean color. Chalky. First off, it's chalky. Oh, right. I really like the finish of it on my skin. I really like it. I really like the rosy cheeks look, so I can have no makeup on, I can have no eye makeup on, but I have to have full cheeks on there, like the bronzer and the blush on. Oh wow, not bad. That's about it, I mean, I just put on too much already. Um, let's just kind of buff that out, <laughs> tone it down. Now, we are going to do the eyeshadow duo. So let's try this eyeshadow duo. Oh no, it's got like the stickers on the side. Okay. So, Obviously, it's a twisted top. It's in the shade. It doesn't say a shade, but as you can see, it's just a really, really... What is this? A plant kind of brown color? Is that a good explanation of it? But it's just a, a shimmery, um, egg, dark eggplant. Also a mauve kind of a mauve blush color. Try that. So that was my chair, that, that wasn't my fart, that was my chair. <laughs> yeah. Alright. I'm just gonna do it um, on a dry brush. So let's try that. Let's use this as a uh, transition color. I'm gonna put it all over my lid, even the bottom of my lid, bottom of the lid, I mean over here, if that, if that makes sense. <laughs> As I'm really bad at explaining stuff, and I'm also new to this whole um, YouTube makeup thing that I have to explain while I do the makeup, so just be patient with me, I'll get there. Um, it doesn't show up much on my skin, 
maybe because I'm a bit tan. I'm yellow tan. I'm not even like really good tan. I'm yellow tan. I'm in the, um, I'm in between being white, I mean being fair skin and between dark skin, the tan skin. So I'm caramel. <laughs> I like to call my skin caramel. If I could just zoom in. No, I can't zoom in. Okay. That's enough. Now we are going to use a flat brush. And we are going to use the shade, the darker shade, and put it on the center of your lid. to bake my face I'm gonna put an under thing first because then I think it's gonna drop all the way on my, my lower I mean here over here Shadow duo, it's it's okay. It's not it's not bad, but it's definitely not fair. Um, maybe I'll have to put on the product. I don't look like a raccoon. Though. Can you see that? Okay, Let's just blend that out. I think that's okay because then I'm doing a natural smoky daytime look for this okay then let us just remove that baking powder baking powder what's in my baking powder just so to catch all the fallout i'm like pop it up pop it up ow would be eyebrows. I'm going to be right back. So now I'm back and we are going to try this lip pencil. It's a lip liner pencil. No, eyeliner pencil. But I'm just going to use this as a lip, uh, lip pencil. No. The struggle when you have nails. With this, this is in the shade Red Bean again.
No. Um. No. Okay, we're just not gonna use that one. Um. Yeah, but because this is an eyeliner pencil and in this color, so I thought it would be good for my lips as well, but... No. Okay, we're just gonna put that aside. We are just going to try the Color Me Beauty Cream Lip Pencil. This is in the shade Chocolate. Chocolate. Okay. That's a cute name. I hope this is okay. Can I just break it? I think I just broke it. Let's just pretend that didn't happen. Oh, I'm a mess. Chocolate. Okay. lip color but just better chocolate your my lip color mm, I like it so creamy guys it's so creamy I definitely like this in terms of longevity and um uh, being really buttery and all these throughout the day, we shall see. Like that. I'm just gonna use a Maybelline Great Lash to finish my look. using um, eyelash filler because it scares me. just going to not put any setting spray so then I can see the actual product without anything on it you know what I mean like how it is without setting spray and that is the final look I really like the look of this the lips I definitely like the color 